want to give all praises. To, want to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem Rakah Kodesh, double honors the apostles and elders of great and so on. Salutations to the hundred four four thousand men, the one third men, women, and children elected to be um, This is uh, Brother Yahweh from GMS Ghana. Hey, Yahweh out here. Shalom. Okay. We want to tell us something about faith, all right? And it's of the. Uh, main precept for this is Romans 14 and 22 because we need faith much more in these times and as, as time as times keep shortening as things keep getting worse we need to exercise our faith we need to understand personally the level of faith we at you know where that this is Romans 14 and verse 22 it says has no faith have it to thyself before you know. Okay. Has thou faith? Do you have faith? Right? Do you have faith? Did the most I gifted you with faith? I'll go to Ephesians 2 and 8, Babusha. You sure that faith is a gift? Which can which can you know strengthen, skillfully add to this precept even more, brother. Okay. This is Ephesians chapter 2, verse 8. For by grace are ye saved through faith. And that not of yourselves, mm -hmm. it is the gift of Yahweh. Okay. So grace and faith is a gift from Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Okay. You know? So if the most I give you though, give you faith, it's supposed to be have it to thyself. You're supposed to have it to yourself. As the scripture said, the kingdom of heaven is like a man that found a pearl. He sold all that he had so that he could get the pearl. You know? And this what the truth is we we given up we we about to give up technically we don't give up everything um since the foundation of the earth but now we have to act out these things so if we have faith we have it to itself all right because this this whole thing is about our own personal relationship between yahweh bashim yahweh shai even though we even though the most have blessed us with with the union and the unity of the akio this part of it as well however we treat brothers is how we treat Yahweh Shai according to Matthew chapter 25. It's the grand scheme of everything. At the end of the day, what kind of integrity you have towards faith that Yahweh Bash and Yahweh Shai gave you on this side. We are on a mission. You know? We are on a mission and your faith is the, is the key to, to the success of this mission. I want to say it here? Um, we still got more in precept, but you know, as a, as a introduction. Yeah, because the precept, the, uh, the scripture says, you know, looking towards the Haushai as the author and finisher of our faith. Yeah. Right? So, that you see the key, you know, um, to faith, the Haushai, you know, Yahu Bashim Yahushai, is there is that faith. Yeah. You see, our faith is the Yahu Bashim Yahushai. That's the Hebrew Israelite faith. The That's thing right. about the true faith. You know what As thou faith, have it to thyself before the bow. Happy is he that condemneth not himself in that thing which he followeth. Alloweth. Alloweth. Okay. Happy is he that condemneth not himself in that thing which he alloweth, right? Um, happy is the man that, that, that don't condemn himself. That even though the scripture said in um, in Second Ezra, when Ezra was, was so meek and humble that he most, most I marvel at that you never consider yourself to be uh, you know righteous or whatever. Let me let me get let me get you know which The thing is the most I didn't uh, marvel it. Remember is um in Jeremiah 5, you know, uh, why I said oh, um, in the womb that you have no the things uh you how about you say no every man you know yeah the, the scripture said the art is desperately deceitful who can know it yeah, how about him you say? You know, cause he's the he's the one that um uh, created, you know, put the, 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 the breath, the life into um what is whatsoever. Huh? Well, yeah, this is second Ezra chapter eight and verse four to nine. It says, In that thou hast humbled thyself as it become a thee, and hast not judged thyself worthy to be to be much glorified among the righteous. Yeah, because the scripture says, right? As well. You know, if any man, let no man deceive himself, if any man think, you know, himself to be anything, he deceive him. Um, 
Slovakian, you see? Um, I have peace mode on this. It says verse 48, in this thou art marvelous before the most high. So we humble ourselves and we don't we don't puff up ourselves and say that we're elect, say that um, you know uh, we don't use our liberty as cloak as malicious, we don't abuse this world or, or you know we, we try not to abuse this world. But the fact that we, we understand that the faith, the grace, all this is, is within the is within the hands of Yahweh Yahushai. So see now we have the faith that Yahweh Yahushai gave us. We have to have it to itself and be happy and condemn and don't condemn itself. You know? Okay. Yeah, this is um, Galatians chapter 6 verse 3. For if a man think himself to be something, when he is nothing, he deceiveth himself. Yeah. You see? But let every man prove his own work and then shall he have rejoiced in himself alone and not in others. Yeah. For every man shall bear his own burden, right? Because you know, prove his own work. In scripture says, um, you know, we, um, you, you know, faith without work is death." Okay. You understand? So faith and work goes hand in hand, right? At the same time, you know, let no man think that he's, he they um, think him. Let me read it again. <laughs> Galatians six and three. For if any man think himself to be something when he is nothing, he deceiveth himself. Because what this going back to um. You know, all our righteousness is as filthy rags. You see? At the end of the day, Yahweh Bashim, this, this is Yahweh, this is of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. You see, the um, Yahweh Shai say, uh, if he come in the um, message of his father, or come in the name of the father, he can glorify himself. Likewise, we, the body of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, we do the same. Right? Yeah, sorry about that. Um, Slack here. Got really, really verse that says, "Bear, bear each other's burden. Bear one another's burden." Yeah, okay, and this is Galatians chapter six, verse two. It says, "Bear you one another burden, and so fulfills the law of a of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach." Good. And you have, and you see, the thing is about faith unto thyself. You have to believe that the Mosai sent these men to correct us, reprove us, and keeping us in the spirit. You know. Keeping us in the spirit, teaching us not to take, not to, not to take up the customs of this world, not to drink the wine and the wine of abomination from Babylon, you know. But you know, everybody, everybody rebellious. The scriptures, everyone, even in law, it, what we mentioned in law, it says, "Revile not the gods and the rulers of thy people," you know. And right now, our rulers, the Most High, set up certain men to lead over us, to guide us to the path, because it's one body, one spirit, one mind. Okay. Um, you wonder, have you have preserved? Um, read back the Romans 14 from the Bible shelf. Romans 14 and 22. It says, Has thou faith, have it to thyself before the power. Have they see that condemn it not himself in that thing which he allow it. Okay. Um, but any more on earth, is it? Huh? Any more on earth, is it? Is it God? Uh, go to 1 Samuel 2 and 35. Samuel 2 and 25 it says and I will rise me up a faithful priest and that shall do according to that which is in my heart mm -hmm. and in my mind mm -hmm. and I will build him a sure house and he shall walk before my, my anointed forever forever and that's talking about Samuel so we gotta we gotta be like minded in this spirit because Samuel's back here the most I raise us up to be faithful priests. We're gonna be a kingdom of priests, right? Most I raise us to be a faithful priest and that shall do according to that which is in mine heart. This within the most I heart, right? The most I spirit and in my mind. You no, know, the mind go back to like thoughts, you know, within the most I thoughts, because our thoughts is not the most I thoughts. So that's why we read this word, we try to apply it as best as we can, and this us um having the faith to our to ourselves before Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. It says, and I will build him a sure house, and he shall walk, and the house go back to your body, the house go back to your household, the house go back to the church, right? 
and I will build him a, ho a sure house, and he shall walk before and he shall walk before mine anointed forever. Walk before the anointed go back to Yahweh Shai and Israel, because Israel is the Most High anointed. Yahweh Shai is the Most High, the, the firstborn among many brethren. Okay, you know. Yeah. So, what's it on? Yeah, it's on the lip. Yeah. Right, it, it, it put me in remembrance of the scriptures when it's uh, um, it's second is just 14. Mm -hmm. Right, um, let me get it. Yeah. Yeah, this second is just chapter 14. We're reading from verse, you know, um, reading from verse 13. It says, Now therefore set thine house in order and yeah. reprove thy people. Ah. Right. Uh, come forth such of them as being in trouble and now renounce corruption. Yep, yep. You know, yep. let go from the mortal thoughts and cast away the burden of man, put off now to weak nature. Go back to see in Galatians 6. You can. There's no point, huh? Is yeah. it clear, you go? Yeah, it is. Um, yeah, Isaiah 42. We jump around a bit. Or we could read, yeah, we could read 1 to 7, man. And this is Isaiah chapter 2 verse 1 4, 2. 4, 2. Yeah, Isaiah 4, 2 verse 1 It says Behold my servant Whom I uphold, uphold Mine elect Mine elect, Bahayar, my chosen Now this will be working toward this why we, That's why we have That's why we have the faith to itself To see if we the elect Now, now Something that a brother say in our camp are resonating with me of these days and I, I hope to hold on to it and hope it be in the spirit. He said that we don't suffer we don't suffer to be the elect. We suffer because we are the elect. You know? Yeah. We suffer because we are the elect. In Wisdom of Solomon chapter 2 it says that they, they, they can say that um, the wicked can try us to see if we 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 gonna um, obey the words of how Bashim Yoshai was reading them before I uh, meet up with the brothers um, today. Right? They're gonna try us, they're gonna, they're gonna test us to see if we we the, the child of the most high because we say that we're the child of the most high. We say that we're the son of the most high. Right? Yeah. We say that we're close to the most high. Can and this way it say it's uh, in cutting out mm -hmm. in wisdom of Solomon chapter two. Yeah, chapter chapter two. two yeah. Right? For he um you know this roughly paraphrasing he, he say he is the son of God. Yeah, yeah, you know, and they are greatly yeah. offended by them. Yeah, yeah, you know, right, yeah. yeah the, the, the scriptures say, um, uh, you know, the yeah, for he is not of our ways. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah. You know, you want, you want to get it? Yeah, you can get that. It's scripture. Yeah, just get to the point. Um, for seven. Okay. Reasonable chunk, that's why they write it up. Reasonable chunk. No, the, the, the point when they say that, you know, for you. Because these are the things that are offending. Mm -hmm. I said, from 12, I guess you could say. Therefore, let us lie and wait for the righteous. Alright. Verse, yeah, this, verse 18. Yeah. For if the just man be the son of Yahweh, he will help him. He will help him. No, 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 it's not, it's not even it's not even So I catch from 12, right? Yeah. It says, therefore, uh, there's um, wisdom of Solomon 1, 2 and 12. Therefore, let us lie in wait for a righteous, for the righteous, because he is not for our turn. He is clean, contrary to our doing. He upbraided us with our offending the law, right? And objects, and objected to our infamy, the transgression, Trans the transgressing of our education. See that? Because we have faith in the in the, in the words of Yahweh Bashim That's why we're going against them. They got faith in the worldly things, we got faith in spiritual things. Right? And this is before Yahweh and men, whether He profess to have the knowledge of God See that? and he call it himself the child of Yahweh Bashim Yoshai. See that? So it says, Has thou faith? We profess in this knowledge of Yahweh Bashim Yahushua is faith. You need faith in order to profess this knowledge day in and day out to stand up against these people. You know? Watch it, what the job, the job, there's so much things going on right now for the job. You can't go to hospital without the job card. You can't
can't go to these different facilities and different recreational places without a job, you know, and they're pushing it on the Caribbean mainly because well, the Caribbean on the developed, so to speak. Yeah. Go ahead. Up. Yeah, verse 14. He was made to reprove our thoughts. You know? Right? Yeah, and that's, that basically was the point. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, because, right. you know, they. Because he called himself the child of Yahweh Bashim Shai, this day they had the entity with the vex. Yeah. You know? What Isaiah? Right, yeah, this is it. Yeah, this is Isaiah 4 the 2. Uh, reading back verse 1. Mm -hmm. It says, Behold my servant whom I upheld, my elect, in whom my soul delighted. Mm -hmm. I have put my spirit upon him. He shall bring forth judgment to the Gentiles. You see that? The most I delighted in us, the most I soul delighted in us, because happy is the man that condemneth not himself in that in that which he alloweth. The most I well, anyway we can get out to it, the most I delight in us, so we can't condemn ourselves. The most I delight in us, like for example, we see 144. A precept might come to mind exactly when you need it. A brother might say something that really hit home to hit home to encourage you. Now the scripture said he that enjoyed the end, but at this point in time. If you in the spirit and still receiving signs from your how about Shimmy Oshai, then you in then, then you in good stead, the most I delight in you. You know? So you can't be condemning because you because you know, your you might the spirit that might be on you all the time. The spirit can't be on you all the time. So you can't condemn yourself. I want I want every I want to think about precepts all the time. I want to pray all the time. Like I could say super group. <laughs> Brother? Yeah. In verse two. You know, and, and just that way of saying that, you know, this life, this life, um, as much as it says, the scripture says, pray without ceasing, you know, and so on. We, we are not to weary ourselves in, with, within the, um, like in terms of faint, you know, push yourself towards the limit that you can faint because the scripture says, you know, um, the override, let me, let me get it. It says, why should thou destroy thyself, right? Yes, it's seven. I think it's um verse. Verse sixteen. I'll read from verse fifteen. It says, "All things have I seen in the days of my vanity. There is a just man that perisheth in his righteousness, and there is a wicked man that prolongeth his life in in his wickedness." Be not righteous over much, neither make thyself overwise. Why shouldest thou destroy thyself? Yeah. See what's going on here? Yeah. So it, even in this same, remember it's a balance, right? You could read through Ecclesiastes, right? The the, the you know the preacher, you know that's <laughs> Solomon did it best. The man, the, the man that was gifted with the, the wisdom, which yeah. we know as the reincarnation of Yahushai, yeah. right? There's times you have to, um, you know, even in this through this faith, you have to know how to deal with this flesh. Mm -hmm. You can't be playing blind on this flesh. You can also, importantly, you can't be playing blind on the spirit because the spirit is our gift. Yeah. You understand? Especially the spirit. Right? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, they even it's, as it's reading in 15, it says, All things have I seen in the days of my vanity. The days of vanity was the numbers of days in this flesh. Because this flesh, as much as we wear it, there's a time we gotta put it off. Yep. And that's what vanity. Okay. Right. See? That's like you read in second Ezra. Um, they go from the more to more to thoughts. Can. Because what they, 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 there's an error, there's a time you can put it off. Yeah. Right? Reading back um, Isaiah 4 to 2. Verse 2. Verse 2. He shall not cry, nor lift up, nor cause his voice to be heard in the streets. Can. So. Uh, the most I call it forty mighty men. So when it said that he shall not cry, we not be like two thirds. The scripture said the mighty men shall shall cry bitterly, but we the mighty for you. How about Hashem Yahushai? We not cry. I mean, Ezra just said, "Woe is me, woe is me." But we will not cry for um crying wickedness. We can cry in righteousness that the most I save us and the most I have mercy on us. Exactly because you know here we protesting, you know, for betterment. Can't, in this can't. kingdom and stuff like that, can't. you know. But however, you know, as I um, say, Isaiah 50, 50, 59, you know, raise, raise up thy voice like a trumpet, mm -hmm. 
and show the people their transgression. Just go this, they kind of cried a bit. Yeah. 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 Shall he not break, and a smoking flax shall he not quench? He shall bring forth judgment unto truth. Yeah. Right, the verse four. He shall not fail nor be discouraged mm -hmm. till he have set judgment in the earth, and so I, I, and the isles shall wait for his laws. Right. So his he law. shall not be discouraged. We shall not be discouraged because we understand that even when we fall, we understand that the Most High didn't come for the righteous. He come for the, the brokenhearted. He come for those that that need salvation. So if you think you got like you got Jake's or the who think that this is the kingdom, who think that this is we, we don't set we got built it up from from this end. You know, scripture say except you have a build it, they live in vain. You know, brother. Right? Verse 5. Thus said the Yahweh power, right? He that created the heaven and stretched them out, he that spread it forth the earth, and that which cometh out of it, he that gave it breath unto the people upon it, mm -hmm. and spirit to them that walk therein. Good. So the more we understand the more sides of one who control this whole thing, he is the one that gives you breath. If you want me to wake up dead, we can wake up dead. According to Kevin Hart, you know? Mm -hmm. How the hell you can go to bed dead? Can you go to bed dead and wake up alive? We did go to, we go to bed with, with, with Babylon and wake up dead. You know? Mm -hmm. We went to bed with the harlot. And now the most I wake we up. Wake we up out of the dead state. Uh, the time you of know? ignorance, you mm -hmm. know? Yeah, winked at. Yeah, yeah. The most I wake you up because he made a promise to um, Abraham. He made a promise to these, to these righteous men that stood stiffly. Where that? Okay. Verse 6. I, Yahweh, um, have called these right in righteousness mm -hmm. and will hold thine hand and will keep thee and give thee for a covenant of the people for a light of the Gentiles. For light of the Gentiles. And this is this where we are right now. Light to the Gentiles. Those Israelites who don't know who they're Israelites are refused to accept that there's it they're Israelites. You know? The stiff neck. You know? Is Israel a homeborn slave? Scripture said can of Ethiopia Ethiopian change the stripes. Israel think as Ethiopians think the um there's Egyptians, Muslims, the thing that's the from fucking space outside of thing. In a way they are, but you know, they think that, you know, like Malachi is the art nonsense, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where not? Verse 7. Mm -hmm. to, op so, to open the blind eyes, mm -hmm. to bring out the, the prisoners from prison, from the prison, and them that sit in darkness out of the prison houses. Good. So we can be cast into prison in darkness. But we cannot be dismayed because we have to have faith to ourselves. The elect will have faith to ourselves before you have Bashim Yahushai. We we trusted in this word for nobody else but we self primarily. Then before you have Bashim Yahushai, and, and being examples towards the men so that we light would shine before the Gentiles, you know. And the light is, is what we lost such as commandments, we applying this word, and you have a shining through. We scripture says, Wisdom causes a man's faith to shine. Can. Yeah, that preset. I think this is um Yeah because the the prison as well, right? It goes back to um you know the change of chains of darkness. Ooh, point, huh? Right? This is um first Peter chapter three You're reading Reading from verse uh, I'll read 18. For Yahweh Shai Mashiach also had once suffered for sin, the just for the unjust, that he might bring us to the power, being put to death in the flesh, but quickened by the spirit, 
by which also he went and preached unto the spirit in prison. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah, there's a point to open the blind eyes to bring the bring out the prisoners and he said he bring us. Yeah, how shall I bring us, right? Yeah. Now we we know it's good like yeah, how I I said, the harvest is plenty, but the laborers are few. No, because it was like the sand in the sea. Yeah. But only one third, one one third and the hundred four thousand men can be saved on this side. Okay. No man know the number, no man no man know if they can be saved, no man know the hour and the how shall you come Yeah, me how shall you come. There's a five precepts. Yeah, that was the, yeah, that was the point. Um, yeah, that's it for the, the um, Isaiah Archie Ali Forja. Yeah. Three and nineteen. To twenty-two. Let's lift the voice up. This is four star three and nineteen. It says, And hereby we know that we are the, of the truth, mm -hmm. and shall assure our minds, our hearts, before him. You see that hereby we know. So through these precepts, through these lessons. Since the first day we came here, we supposed to know, and that's why the elders and apostles of Great Minnesota always ask, "Do you understand what you're part of?" And you got, and you know, they got, they got audio that I download from Elder Elder um, Elder Gabar, Elder, Elder Apostle Gabar. He says that gut check. You got to check your guts, check your bubbles. Like scripture said, "Gird up your loins." Do you understand what you're part of? Things, the things that we. It's not okay, wasn't it? That's why it's good to tell you what it's about. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, you set your body up with your big sacrifice. Yeah. Because when you go out there, you actually move from the altar, you sacrifice it for your house. Mm -hmm. Right? Right. Yeah. You understand what you're part of, and, and, and within the sacrifice as well. Um, understand that we could be the firstborn of many brethren, help create all of this. To see our maker, to be crowned, to 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 you know to be glorified. Imagine the Most High God, the Most High Creator, the Most Powerful Being in the world, glorifying you because you obey will to the best of your ability. He called you towards a purpose. He chose you for this particular function. You know, going up. Verse twenty. For if our hearts condemn us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, how is greater than our heart? You see, right. the we'll go back to the Romans 14. Happy is he that condemneth not himself, brother. And okay. knoweth all things. And knoweth all things. For if our heart condemn us, yeah, how is greater than our heart? And knoweth all things, brother. That's why it's good to say, um, second of your sins Let not your sins be you know. uh -huh. right. Yeah, because he know all things. He don't know that, we, that this flesh would destroy we without him. He don't know we create. He don't know what we capable of. That's why scripture said the most high exact less than we, we deserve. And you don't give him more than you could bear. Greater. Verse 21. 21. Beloved, mm -hmm. if our hearts condemn us not, and have we confidence towards the power. So if we heart con don't condemn we, that's why we go back to the Romans 14, 22. Faith again. Faith again. You have faith in towards the like, have faith to thyself right. before you how about shim your shy. Right. Then confidence what confidence means. Can't mean with and fidel means faith. Right. And that's another reason too, because remember, you know, we were once carried away by dumb idols. Yep, yep. You know, you could be on the highways and byways and man say, hey, you used to be so so so. Mm -hmm, Alright, mm -hmm. now if you can be condemned by enough by going back to the past and said by hey, I was like the by I was scum by you know the demon for drag you out. That means you don't have confidence in the Lord that you are a new man and all things have passed away. Ah. You know? Yeah. Um, 22. 22. And whatsoever we ask, we receive of Him mm -hmm. because we keep His commandments Ooh. and do those things which are pleasing in His sight. Can. Which goes back to James or as far as John. When it says, um, if we ask something not wavering, Right? Because we suppose our confidence that Yahweh will gonna hear me. So if we ask for more faith, you gotta be the most I can put you in a situation for you apply the faith. It's not like you can just sprinkle some magic dust. He put you through these scenarios so that you would grow. Because he's a nerd wisdom is a nurturing spirit. Wait said wisdom will try you by her laws to see if you're worthy and then reveal these mysteries to me. That's true. You wanna say something? No. Like you wanna say anything else? Yeah, but you know, it's on point. Yeah. 
So with that, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahushai, Ba'ashem, Ba'ashem, Double honesty, the apostles and elders of great and so on and salutation God your father. Four thousand men, the one third men, women, and the children like to be saved. Wadi Al Bashim Yah Shai for bringing us together for do this lesson and putting it in our spirit. For edify the body and a bad babal. Okay. A bad babal. A bad babal. A bad babal. A bad babal. Shalom. Shalom.